Yo, what's up guys? Before we get into the video, I do want to say thank you all for your support. It means a ton to me. Please like and subscribe. Today we did hit on Supreme. We did hit with Viper AIO. Uh, I did. I even went late. My proxies were a little messed up in the beginning. I did hit a PS5, uh, two PS5 orders. I know I'm getting a lot of hate about that on some of my posts. Not hate from the community, hate from like eBay sellers. I think there's like bots saying how bad it is, blah, blah, blah. Um, and then moving forward, Thank you, shout out to Tracker, shout out to Tommy Boy TV. Y'all are hitting me with the monitors all the time. Viper AO cooked this morning, I was super hype on that. These biohacks are lit, I'm glad we got them. And I have the Air Jordan 5 Oregons coming in. So that's what there is to look forward to. I hope you guys do like this. Um, so now let's move on to the video. Yo, what is up guys, Trevor Ross Kavinsky here. On today's episode, we are gonna be unboxing a package from some place that I've never got a package from before simply because I can never get through checkout. We finally got our biohacks in. This is a size 6 NGS. I did hit a lot of restock. Um, it took me like an hour to hit the restock. I was I did manual. Manual waited for that thing to spin, spin, spin. So yeah, I'm happy to finally see these in hand. I know a lot of people have got them a while ago, but we're gonna go ahead and go over it. So let's go ahead and get everything unboxed here. That was fast size, there's a little bitty box. Box in okay condition. We got the size six, we got the invoice right here, thankfully. We'll go ahead and open it up. It is packaged decently. All right, all right, I see this. Nice, nice. Wow. The colors are actually insane. I've seen pictures and everything all over these. Like, I, I mean, I've seen them everywhere. Simply because, you know, they've been out for a little while now. This is the first one I did hit. The tread on the bottom is actually nice. It's got a little thing around here, which is a little bit different. Um, geez, these are a nice Air Jordan One. I'm not gonna lie. I don't know how. I don't know if I'd be able to rock these. Um, there is some like dirt on them, unfortunately. It looks like. Geez, shoe palace. There's a little something on the thing. Maybe that's what it's supposed to be like. Let's go ahead and grab out the other shoe real quick. I just want to restock. Nope, it's not supposed to be on there. They give me an Air Jordan sticker, which is yeah, it's okay. There's that. We'll move over here. There's a little something on it, which is unfortunate. We will have to see. We have some email. Not too worried. They're still they're obviously not out of like a bad condition. But yeah, overall, I think the colors are very vibrant. As you can see on the tongue, it's just the colors they pop. This would be really hard to go with an outfit for me. I would have a hard time doing this. I like how the swoosh is silver, the back, it's got the light blue, bluish right here. Um, and the brown. The, the colorway is insane. It's crazy to think that they would pull a colorway together like this, but it is what it is, you know how it goes. The, I mean, I'm not surprised, it's just, wow. I think overall these shoes, once again, I, I like them, but I personally did not get for personal. Obviously they're size six. I did try to go for normal sizes, but let's be honest, I would not rock these. On a scale of one to 10, simply for the colors and stuff, I'd give these like a six or a seven, simply because I would barely be able to wear these. I don't have outfits or anything. It would be really hard for me to color coordinate these. Um, let's move that on over there. It'd be really hard for me to color coordinate these and I think these would look good on a shelf. I really wish I had like a shelf to throw them on, but um, I'll be selling these pretty soon, I think. I know people are saying hold on to GS sizes. GS sizes are doing awesome. Here, we'll move these back here so you can see them. GS sizes are doing really, really well. Uh, I think they're doing just about as good as the normal sizes on these. We will put a little StockX number here. That's GS sizes and we'll compare it to the normal size. Uh, we'll get them. I'm gonna get them listed on Goat right now, and yeah, uh, let me know. Please like and subscribe if you like this video. Let me know what you like about the whole table setup. I'm trying to get the microphone and everything good to go. I'm out of here, guys. Peace.